Good morning, Phoenix High School. I'm Jordan Stevens. And I'm Bailey Tobute. Last weekend, our DECA team competed at the state competition in Portland. KJ Saharath was a state championship a state champion in quick serve restaurant marketing and quali qualified for the international competition. Celine Fairmont finished fourth place in hotel lodg lodging marketing out of 70 72 competitors. Claire and Deva Guy finished seventh in travel and tourism marketing team event. James Vanderlip and Madison Betro finished ninth in business, law, and ethics team event. KJ, KJ Saharath and Celine Fairmont finished ninth in hospitality marketing team event. Congratulations to our vocal and percussion solo and ensemble participants for their performances over the past two weekends. This year's singing participants were Julia Holden Hunkins, uh, Sierra Cox, Rain Milam, Lindsay Burns, and the percussion ensemble members Brian Ortiz, Zoe Rose, Megan Keith, Lindsay Burns, and Rain Milam. Congratulations also to Lindsay Burns for qualifying for state for the third year in a row in her Maramba performance of two Mexican dances. The PHS Comedy Club will be hosting their first shows on March 14th and 15th in the Rose Theater. All their proceeds will be going to the Sparrow Club, and this is Scotty Lewis's senior project. Here's a video that Joey Larimer, Joey Larimer made to give more information. know me my name is Owen Lopez I am one of the um, comedic stand-ups in the comedy show which will be showing March 15th and March 14th hopefully for those of you who decide there may be interest there is possibility in joining though I don't know and I cannot say for I'm not the spokesperson but alas come to the show I hope that you all enjoy it So I thought it'd be really nice for me to make a hat for Judah because he goes ballistic over these balloons. I make a long tube so it, 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 it looks like a top hat and a round part so it fits over the top of his head. Then I took two other balloons and put them on the top. They floated down and rearranged themselves. Judah didn't mess with the balloon and I wasn't paying attention. My mom screams at me, Owen, oh, what is on his head? And I look and there is a male organ upon my baby brother's head. <laughs> Lisa say I was grounded and I'm no longer allowed to play with balloons. <laughs> We should definitely go to that one, Jor. Yeah, we should. <laughs> In some other news, the Snack Corner is now a full-service lunch area. Use your meal account or pay cash for a hot sandwich made for you or one of their rotating specialty entrees. To all students interested, mediation <laughs> training continues at lunch in Mr. Cornett's room. On to other news. This is for the faculty. The Community 101 group in leadership is giving away $1,000 to anyone who wants to apply. For more information, talk to Ms. Hale or come to the leadership class during fourth period. If you don't remember, the Pirates to Raiders program is every Wednesday until just before spring break. Make sure to talk to Javier in the College Corner if you have any questions. Ms. Blanchett would like to thank all the students here at PHS. Because of the tardies have been reduced from 20% of students to having tardies to only 3%. New rules are being brought up about the students skipping. If you're caught skipping, you will get an after-school detention. If you're caught skipping during a block period, you will receive two after-school detentions. So make sure to go to all of your classes. Also, we'd like to recognize some of our staff members that don't always get recognized for their hard work. Here's a video that Joey and Zach made.
So my name is Tony Shreve, and I work at Phoenix High. I make the breakfast, um, prepare all the breakfast for the mornings, and jump in and help out wherever is needed. I am known kind of within my company for being the wild, crazy cafeteria lady. <laughs> I like to have fun, and I like to put smiles on people's faces. Um, I'd like to think that my contribution to Phoenix High is to provide meals for those that may not have one and to uh, make them with love. Hi, my name is Miss Sandy. I am the high school registrar. I also have an advisory class, which I am so honored to have. But primarily my job is high school registrar. Each minute, each hour changes, but on a daily basis, um, it's enrolling any students who walk into our office um, from outside the district, outside the state, um, or students who are withdrawing from Phoenix High School and going uh, elsewhere. I also mainly work on your transcripts. All the grades that are permanently placed there go through me, any grade changes report cards, um, so that would be transcripts and report cards and another main thing I work on. I hope that I contribute to Phoenix High School um, a positive hope as a liaison between um, students, um, other staff members, their parents, uh, administration, and um, kind of like the threshold that of a door that I'm the first person they see when they come in to um, look at Phoenix High School. I'm Scott Solderman, piano player, and I'm accompanied here at Phoenix High School. I come in for choirs at uh, 8.30 uh, for the chamber choir and concert choir uh, following and uh, perform all sorts of fun music. I think that I contribute a lot of good music background for the uh, vocalists here at the school. I've also performed with the uh, jazz band and the musical theater. My name is Karen Perry. I am known as the custodian at Phoenix High School. So well, my day starts around 6 o'clock in the morning. I unlock the entire building and then I start cleaning in the gym commons area. Um, pick up all the garbage I find on the floors after lunch, after break, laundry, and then I set schedules up for the evening custodians so they know what rooms to clean and what their duties are for the evening. Um, set up for the games, clean up after all the games. Also clean up after special events, dances, and um, whatever else students have going on in the building. I basically try to keep a healthy, clean learning environment for the students and the faculty. If you are interested in a medical career, applications are now being accepted for MedStars 2013. This is a highly competitive week-long camp to help students get an experience in a medical career and only 10 students will be accepted from our region. The application will be due April 5th and attach a current copy of your transcript. Also, all the students <coughs> interested in attending the State Drama Conference, you need to turn in your deposit no later than March 5th. This year's theme is Legally State. The dance themes are Phantom of the Opera and Disney. Over 800 students attend this conference, so this will be a great opportunity to have fun and meet new people. Again, the deposit is due by March 5th. Do you think your mom is the best? <laughs> well, if you do, help Phoenix High School win $1,500 by entering the Skyline Food Essay Contest for Mother's Day. Daniel Kelly has created a segment to give more information, so let's check that out. Mother's Day is coming up. And there's no way to show your mother how much you love her than by winning her a brand new car. No joke, Crater Lake Ford is holding a contest with the prize of a $10,000 car. That's right, you can win your mom a car or win yourself $500.
buy like two Xboxes with that. Some tacos. But if you're one of those people that's like, eh, my family has enough cars and enough cash, well then here's the kicker. If we're the school with the most entries, we can win this fine establishment $1,500. Bada bing. That's cool. Like, wow, we could really use that. You may be thinking, hey, Mr. Guy on my TV screen, how do I enter this competition and win these fabulous prizes? Well, I'm glad you asked. All you have to do is write an essay about your mom and how she's the greatest mom in the world. Oh, but I don't like writing essays. <laughs> you're gonna do it anyways. You, you gotta, you're gonna do it anyways. It's gonna happen. You'll be doing your school a favor, you'll be doing yourself a favor, and you'll be doing your mom a favor. This is just a good thing to do. Please, just do it for the children, or, um, <clears throat> or your mom. Yeah, do it for your mom. I mean, or yourself, or the school, but preferably your mom. So, let's take a step back and review. Step one, write an essay about why your mom's the greatest in a maximum of 250 words. There are printouts of the official contest rules outside of the front office. Be sure to pick that up before you start writing. Step two, go to craterlakeford.com and click on the Mother's Day banner. You'll be able to submit your essay from there. Three. Wait until March 14th when the winners are announced and you might be cruising down the road with your mom and a couple of Xboxes and tacos. Yeah. So get out there and write an essay about your awesome mom. Thanks, BHS. Get to writing. Stay frosty. Submit your essay soon, because deadline is March 11th. How do I get out of this warehouse anyways? FFA News, there will be a mandatory record book meeting Tuesday at 3.30 for all members wanting to show animals at fair. Also, the FFA would like to thank all the students who brought in food this month for the Les Schwab food drive. We raised 1,890 pounds of food for the community kitchen. The students who brought in the most food was Kayla Bradley. In second place was, the, was a tie between Grace Warner and Tyler Ramsey. And in third was Amanda Hare. You can all collect your prize from Ms. Kostman. Also, Tuesday, March 7th, all members planning to raise an animal at the school farm, there will be a meeting at, school, at the school farm going over all the procedures and policies. The next meeting will be March 12th at 6 o'clock in the Commons. This will be the degree ceremony for first year and second year members, but all members are invited to attend. A lot of students here at PHS are not aware of the opportunity to participate in the multiple clubs we offer at the school. To provide you with some more information on a few of the clubs here at PHS, Daniel Kelly and Isaac McDaniel created a segment, Roll It. 